Hi friends, when you start getting visitors at your WordPress website, you need to understand them. You need to analyze all visitors. You under you wish to understand their behavior at your website. And at iCreate, we are exploring all those solutions through which you can really make a wonderful WordPress website in no time without having any technical knowledge. So this is iCreate platform and you are welcome to join. And in this video, we are going to watch how simply we can analyze the page widgets of our website visitors. So it is an alternative to Google Analytics solutions. Of course, that is a very good solution. That is very advanced solution. But here from the WordPress dashboard, we are going to analyze our website, WordPress website visitors. So as always, I have a great plugin and it is called Advanced Page Widget Counters and it is the most wanted analytics plugin for WordPress and it has been developed by Page Widget Counters. It has a good number of installs and it is being regularly updated as well. So I'm going to show you how it works through its install interface and you can get this plugin through the video description link both versions premium and the free versions are available so you can use start using free version and later you can decide uh, if you really like this you can take premium version as well so let us go to the plugin screen so this is dashboard of advanced page widget counter and this dashboard is summarily showing everything about visitors at our WordPress website. So total number of widgets in last one year, total widgets month, week, today, or visitors, views, user sessions, first time visitors. So you can filter everything what, so there is a limited data. This is a demo installation coming from the uh, plugin developer itself. So I have yet not installed this. So this is premium version layout and I am demonstrating only and you can check all these things so the graphical analysis will be available here once the data gets uh, uh, processed at this installation and you can see the page id page title page views and user session uh, further page links can be visited so you can check all these things from the dashboard itself and next at the next screen uh, the trending reports and all such things are here so i'll show you First of all, settings screen uh, through which you can onboard on the plugin. I mean, uh, onboard on the system to count the page widgets. And the setting screen, first you have to enable the counters and you can disable as well. Uh, you can uh, choose to show the icon and the uh, where you want to show the icon, like below the content and wherever. Block users, so you can select the block users uh, for which the plugin is going to work I mean for admin or the other users you can select here and uh, the blog post page counts the default border radius and basic settings for this plugin and the layout is available here and further you can uh, change the labels as well like total widget total two days widgets and you can change these labels I mean the, these text as well and you can uh, choose the template as well so there are different templates available for the widgets that is available uh, with the plugin itself and the advanced settings so you can use to update the geographic data manually however it, the geographic database will be updated every uh, on every two weeks automatically so just to grab the correct information the geographic data update is necessary so it the same process is also being used by the rest of the visitor analysis system i believe so this is a very advanced setup uh, i mean the simple to use but advanced in action uh, you can say and this plugin is really going to help you in understanding the visitor behavior at your wordpress website like block uh, premium under premium settings you can find the block count by the country like you can select the web and you can decide the uh, block count by the country like you can select the specific country hide widgets counter for users uh, and you can decide how you want to show the widgets similarly a hide widget based on user rules the options is also 
available here. So this is the onboarding setting for your plugin. And in the premium features of this plugin, you are going to get the sort code. So uh, premium version and gain access a special code, uh, sort codes, blocks, you won't find anywhere else. Okay, that is fine. Real time statics that is available in the premium version, e-commerce statics and the premium settings and export data options, campaign settings, uh, campaign statistics. So this, these all things are available in the pre premium version. Now coming back to the dashboard, uh, you have already seen this interface. Trending. So which page is trending at your website like top 10 pages and top 10 posts can be seen here on this screen. Reports. So this is the uh, advanced filter based reports and you can further apply the filters that you want to uh, apply like post pages and further uh, the reports can be generated here. In the next screen, we can see the references, the visitors coming from the, like uh, targeting referrer. Uh, we can detect the targeting referrer and the user sessions, views and visitors can be seen here. Further, as I said, uh, in the premium version, widgets are available, sort codes are available. You can use these sort codes for placing at your website. So like widgets uh, 999 today 123 total. So these are widgets that you can place at the, at the different pages or post at your website. So this is really a good cool thing. So real time visitors since uh, this is a demo instance and it don't have any real time visitors, but it can be seen here on this screen for the page title views, campaigns, countries and referrals can be seen here. WooCommerce again, so this is a very good report module for WooCommerce websites as well. So you can grab all the reports uh, that is for gross sales and the returns, coupons and all these details. And the product, uh, most viewed products can be seen here. This is really very important for an e-commerce store and the most selling products can be seen here. So this is also very helpful uh, report for the orders processing and understanding the products that is available at your store. Campaigns, if you are running the campaigns that are like uh, promotional campaigns, Google campaigns, Facebook, so you can track the campaigns here and the landing page can be tracked here and uh, you can create new campaigns here. You can place the URL and the landing path and the source and the medium and the campaign. Uh, so everything that you run under a campaign can be tracked here like bio link and all so this is a very com good campaign tracking so this is simple interface as i said the google analytics is the most uh, most advanced thing for analysis analyzing the visitors at your website and it is a uh, bit complicated as well so it is not very commonly used by a simple and uh, non-technical users but this interface can be used without any technical knowledge and without any technical control. You just need to install the plugin in the proper manner and uh, set up the things that you want. Export is the option where you can export the data and you can further analyze the data in other formats. Like uh, if you are using any marketing funnel tools, you can export the data for that. Setting we have already seen and here there is an also option also an option to delete all the data just in case if you wish to delete all the data that has been grabbed by the plugin it can be done through, through this signal click so all good things are here you can start analyzing the page widgets and the visitors and you can start the complete analysis of your visitor and you can further uh, decide the campaigns and understand how your products and the pages contents are working and performing for your website so i believe this is a great solution and you can grab this through the video description link in the next video i'm coming with more solution keep watching keep reading thank you